And ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the KB Show, a great show for all content. You are tuned in to the music contest of the show with an anonymous singer, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to be finding out more. Stay tuned in the show, ladies and gentlemen. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and always interact with us on our Facebook page, Lord, uh, at the KB Show. Stay tuned. Sazolam na. My name is Hippie So, but I was uh, my, my stage name is Hannathan Chris. And I, I started having my own passion for music in grade grade seven at the age of eleven years old. And um yeah, my I, my the artist that inspired me to sing was Beyonce and Ariana Grande and Mariah Carey as well. They actually gave me the passion to start my own music and actually be the artist that I am right now. Thank you for your time and uh living in South Africa is actually um the best thing that could ever happen to anybody because this place it's very, very cultural and beautiful. And they have, that is what it is called, the Illumination, because it is open to the community. Because the people are friendly, some people are friendly, of course. And um, I. <laughs> yeah. The challenges that I face as a teenager, a 16 year old teenager, are puberty, of course, and peer pressure. But I don't usually mind that a lot. I. um. I, I was I was actually oh, the challenge that I face in my teenage years is my spirituality. I do have difficulties with God, but I believe that one day it will be, I don't know, maybe God will uh, answer my prayers and hopefully I will be the artist and I'll reach my international dream. I know I will. Thank you for your time. And please feel free to check us on The Gabby Show on Facebook, on Twitter, anywhere you can uh, feel free. Thank you. And ladies and gentlemen, Simzile Ute Pisom Rakane from Whitbank, South Africa. As he mentioned his background and how living in South Africa is treating in him and who inspired him. Oh, of course, every everyone is being inf inspired by Upionse because he's she is famous and she is high class and that is a very beautiful and lit ladies and gentlemen my now we are going to ask a few questions from Utepi. so first of all Sfuna Ustjele Utepi so Uti exactly exactly how did you start the music career I I heard you you said you started at grade 7 and you were inspired by Beyonce but you're gonna mention exactly how the music industry has treated you how how far have you become and later on we're going to get a performance from you yeah, actually uh treated me very very good because i found passion in my voice and i actually inspired myself to be where i am right now i stopped a lot of things i made a lot of sacrifices due to um improving myself improving my voice and becoming who i am today um music has been uh quite hard for me because some people usually left and they were uh, very very music um it's been very good it's been a good uh good path for me because i i think that many people young people usually they hide themselves they hide their own voices because they shy they found no confidence in themselves they think what other people actually care about them when you see uh as, as a teenager music actually is my hiding place i can say it's where i hide myself from the world and from people who actually influence me in a bad way but i can say that music uh <laughs> is something that's actually out of this world it's it's something that we should hold on to as people young people i'm talking to the young people right now music if you want to find your own hiding place just go to music run to music music will heal your heart it will give you peace and inner joy if you want to but if you cannot sing or you can just listen to music and pretend to sing i actually um i downloaded a manual from play store and it taught me a lot actually a lot of things i knew that there was um head singing and chest singing and also head singing i'm a voice um these type of rages they actually uh help me to find my voice because there's exercises including zigzags for the chest and many different type of voices but i usually stick to the stomach voice where i only flow in the um in the rage that i'm in uh, that i'm in of course <laughs> oh my god <laughs> okay um so like singing is actually something that i gained 
when I was actually seven years old. I start. I I I actually um uh ish. okay. I actually discovered that I can sing when I was seven years old, but I actually took it more seriously in grade 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 seven years. So like singing is actually um, a journey that you have to start patiently. That I endured using my um those exercises that I did. My siblings thought that I was I was crazy because those exercises were actually kind of um kind of um crazy sounding it would be crazy so people would say that he's crazy he's mad but when i saw the results okay but exactly exactly tell us so the uh, those moves which which exercises are you mentioning is they know. seem crazy yeah i want to know oh okay no problem uh, it's actually uh zigzags but if you want to learn that one you can just like be like one two three four 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 three two one that's how it is wow that's beautiful yeah <laughs> thank you um it's actually not my own uh uh it's not my doing it's actually a manual that i got from you see there's many types of exercise out there like brrr. see they sound stupid but they really yeah because it, they, they they always say that um many things which may shine on the outside are not good in the inside exactly. and many things which may shine in the inside are dull in the outside so it simply means that uh, there is a secret behind this exercise and that secret is to achieving good music exactly. right exactly good voice and good ranges I'm looking forward to um having a range like likened to Ariana Grande because she has a very good range. She can do whistle notes and I can do whistle notes too. Do yes, know? we all know that Ariana Grande is one of the toppers. I mean, I mean, he's, she's she, famous and she's lit. Yeah, exactly. Like I can do many ranges. There's resonance and I can do a whistle note. Whistle note, do you wanna, uh, want me to uh, yes, 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 yes. demonstration? Okay. Um, yes, of course. Wow, how do you do that? I mean, I can do that. <laughs> ah, my voice is even... My, my, my range is still low. I need to go up. You see, that's why I'm saying I'm looking uh, I'm looking up to Ariana Grande because she can reach really high. And Mariah Carey too because I actually discovered that I can do some notes because of Mariah Carey. She, I, li I listened to her music and I was very, very inspired by her, her whistle notes because they were very good. Yeah, that's how i got to know that i can do with some notes and i can do opera too but not not i don't i don't actually find my passion in opera, opera because it's kind of hard for me <laughs> yeah and yeah that's how it is how i how i actually found my whistle notes and my yeah. uh rages okay cut. um the reason i sing my music in english is because uh i find english more uh, comforting this is Zulu and other languages are actually quite hard for me because I in, I actually feel more comfortable using English words than other languages. Yeah, but mostly I, I, I do sing a bit of this is Zulu, but not much. But uh, but uh, on this case, I English is not your your mother's tongue, yes? But <laughs> tell me exactly, why why do you find English interesting? Is, is it because it is heard by everyone in the, in, in the whole world? Okay. Yeah, because uh, because let's say you don't hear the the language of Chinese, okay. and the Chinese don't hear don't don't hear your language. Okay. You have to speak English so that you can enrich them, right? Of so course. is that the reason why you are using English in your music? No, not really. I, I I actually I don't know. It's in me. It was in me to actually enjoy English, and it's like naturally I I actually gained uh and uh a, um. And it's actually in my bloodstream to actually um, to, to speak English or to actually find English more comforting because some languages are actually quite hard, naturally. For me, I don't find them more uh, fun or more, more violent to my, um, my, my, or my own mentality. That's why I, I actually don't enjoy English. Oh, that's... I mean, other languages, of course. <laughs> <sighs> okay, 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 Tepi. So thank you for telling us uh, all of this. But uh, obviously, my audience, the Gabby's fans, are expecting a lot. Not just an interview, because an interview <laughs> is kind of boring. They say, okay. yeah, it's not your career to do interviews, but your career to sing. Same so we, we we really expect a performance from you. Can, can you really give us a performance? Yeah, I can. I can. Okay, I thank can. you. Thank and you. I really thank love you. to give you 
your fans on the Gabby show. I'm very, I'm very happy that you have me, you had me on the show, and um, a lot of thanks to you and your fans. And I give you all um the best. Heads up, continue what you what you're doing. May God bless you in all everything that you do. Thank you for your time and thank you for having me on the Gabby show. I ain't got nothing. I got you. If I ain't got something, I don't give a damn. Cause I got it with you. I don't know much about algebra, but I know one plus one equals two. And it's me and you. That's all you have when the world is through. Cause baby, we ain't got nothing but love. And all that you got enough for the both of us. Come on, baby, make love to me. Like the world's at a war. Pull me in close and don't let me go. Make love to me. Well, I like my days feel low right now, baby. Make love to me. Oh, I'll make love to me. I don't know much about guns, but I, I've been shot by you, yeah, yeah. I don't know when I'm gonna die, but I hope that I'm gonna die for you, hey. I don't know much about fighting, but I, I hope I'll fight for you, I hope I'll fight for you. Hey, just when I follow my first story life That I'm laying right next to you, baby We ain't got, baby, we ain't got Nothing but love And all in you got enough For the both of us Woo! <laughs> Make love to me Loving can hurt Loving can hurt sometimes It is the only thing that I know no. mm -hmm. I know we can get hard I know we can get hard sometimes it is the only thing that makes us feel alive mm -hmm. We keep this love in a photograph We make these memories for ourselves Where our eyes never closing Hearts forever broken Stars forever shining So you can keep me Inside the pocket of your wept Chains holding me closer till I eyes me, and you won't ever let me go. Wait for me to come home.